Okay, here's where we left off. As you can see, what we need to do is add our arms in. And I'm just going to add one. And then I will mirror this over um, off camera in between classes. So as you can see, the only thing I've done since last class is put in a cylinder here. It's eight sides with four segments. Is all it is. Just a regular old tube. So let's move this over. Have it intersect with our body. Like so. Okay. That looks okay. So now, let's turn off all of our other geometry. Go to our body layer. And go to mesh edit. Boolean union. Say okay. But as you can see, that causes problems because we didn't subdivide our cube first. So, let's go back. Let's go to our arm. Tab key, subdivide it. Let's grab that in, hit the B key, and click to bevel it out. Grab this in, hit the B key to bevel, click to bevel it out. Now, this is going to be the sleeve to the dress. So now we can go back to our body. Now that we're both sub D'd, objects are both sub D'd, we can go to mesh edit, boolean, union. Okay. Now we have problems. But once again, we need to go in here and fix these problems. So just bear with me while we go through here and join these verts. I'm going to join those. There's three there. Looks like there's a few right there hidden. We want to make sure we got those and not all the way around. Okay, now let's see here. What's next? Um, that's just one vert. Let's go ahead and join these and see what happens here. Let's see if that helps, and I think it will. Let's go ahead and join all these right there. That'll help clean up underneath. Let's just work at this here. Those join together. Now we're slowly getting a smoother result here. Let's join these like that. Um, let's go ahead and join these. Let's go under here now and see if what we got here. Like there's three verts there and you can check by going down here in your right corner Let's join those we'll join these we'll join those two okay we're coming along here Now we got a smooth backside, so let's go on and see what we can do here. Um, let's see if we can find our vert there. Our vert there. I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to do this or not, but we'll see. We got a slight problem there, so let's go ahead and see if we can't fix all that. Okie dokie. Let's go ahead and slice this up while we got sub D mode here. While we're in sub D mode. Okay, there we go. Now, it looks like to me, we have us a joined arm. Now, I might go ahead off camera and fix my geometry by running some loop slices right around here like this.
just bear with me while I'm running my loops here. I want to make sure my geometry is clean. Sometimes you gotta monkey with it. Okay, now let's see here. Let's go to our edges. Remove that edge. Now you can see we got some wonderful flowing geometry right around through there. And on this side too. All of them go all the way across. And they come straight up the arm and all the way around the body. We have a wonderful, wonderful arm there. So now we can select that end and get rid of it. Okay. Now let's go ahead and delete the arm that we originally used for Boolean. And there we go. In our next tidbit, we will... I don't know if we'll add the arm, the hand maybe or maybe we'll do a little bit of detail work on the uh, dress here I'm not real sure but when I come back this will no this won't be mirrored yet I'm gonna wait till I get the arm completely finished before I mirror it over okay so there is our sleeve um, I'm not sure if I will extrude this in to make it look like a shirt or if I'll build one over top of it I just haven't really thought about it yet so uh, we'll see you in the next video